Okay, we're going to take the one lap Camaro, 67 Camaro, owned by James Shipka, around streets of Willow Springs. Turn two, okay, and feed it wide. Let the car come down here, kind of middle of the racetrack. I'm looking for my apex, set of rumble strips. Come on up. And come on around this corner here. Straighten her out, bring it a little right, bring it left. Into a little small sweeper here. up to third here. And Come on, you bitch turn. Get in this corner right so you get a good entry. the back end of this car underneath me. This thing's a pretty hard car to drive. <clears throat> Always got to break in a straight line with this car or things get really ugly really quick. <clears throat> get your butt around there. Come on, baby stick. have a cool down lap. So what I'm trying to do here is just kind of get myself acclimated, stay wide, downshift into my second gear, come around, upshift to third here, let the car come down, break in a straight line, lightly get around the corner, center of track, acquire my apex, Come on up. That was a little late. Now I'm looking ahead. I'm looking towards this right-hand turn. Come through the right-hand turn. Acquire my rumble strips for my left-hand turn. Come on up here. Straight into my big sweeper. Going to touch in here. Let the car feed out. Acquire my rumble strips. Medium apex in there. Head on down through here, I'm in third gear. I'm gonna kinda kiss this side, kiss this side, and now I'm gonna go straight. I'm acquiring my left hand turn up here. Brake, medium to late apex. I want the car on the left side of the track. I'm acquiring my, my berm right here. Through here, a berm here, through here, and straight out and then around to go do it again. Cool. And now what I do is I'll go ahead and I will drive the car up and down this length of lane to cool down the brakes. But whenever I come in off of a hard track lap, a session, I'll always go drive and just let the brakes get cool, cool, cool. Whenever I park the car, I'll always park it. Um, in gear, never with a parking brake on or anything like that. You don't want the hot pads to lock onto a spot on the rotor and then warp the rotor.